Hi there. Scratch is the free website where you can learn to code and apply your creativity online. Let's review the steps of creating a free Scratch account. This will only take a few minutes. You can watch the video and follow along. I'm at the Scratch website right now. The address for the website is scratch.mit.edu. The homepage looks like this. If you have a login, great. You don't need to watch this video actually, but if you don't have a login, here's what we're going to do. You're going to join Scratch by clicking this link in the upper right. It'll take you to a page where you can create your account. You'll need a username and then a password. So your username, um, as you can see, Scratch recommends that you don't use your real name. Um, so I'm going to create a username for myself. Let's see if it's available. Okay, so that's my username. Um, then it's time to create a password. I'm going to uncheck show password so that when I type in my password, um, it will be private to any eyes. But if you want to, um, if you want to double check what you're writing, you can check this box, show password, and it will reveal what you're typing. I'm going to just un... Okay, it asks you to type your password in twice, just to make sure that, um, that you're typing it correctly. So the second box is just confirmation of what you've typed in the first box. When you've got that set, you've typed in a username, a password, and you've confirmed your password, go ahead and click this orange area, which is a button, next. A little survey, what country do you live in? When were you born? Let's say, so I was born now. And then uh, this is just some information um, that you can fill out. If you don't want to fill it out, you can check the box. It says you don't want to fill it out. And finally, um, you gotta put your email in. This is important. This is how you get to um, get reminded of of your account, your password information if you forget it, um, any news on the website. This is a free account and it is your account. So even after the workshop, you can keep on using Scratch and keep on learning and being creative and using the tools here on your own or with other groups. So put in your email and then click this orange um, text that says create your account. Easy as that. Um, if you get the screen, it says welcome. That's good news. Your account's been created. Write down your username and password somewhere safe where you can remember it so that you can log in again in the future. And then you can click get started. Go to the website. And now you actually see a whole bunch of things here. Um, and I encourage you to, to explore and um, have your login ready uh, first thing uh, Monday morning. All right.